Good day, all. I come to you again, this time to talk about our Latin experience here at St. Margaret's. I know you received a letter from me in, in, in the, uh, about the Lenten schedule, also in the bulletin, but I just wanted to speak directly to you about making the Lent a very good experience for you. Uh, we have stations across uh, every Friday, 12.15 in, in the chapel and 7 o'clock in the church. The 12.15 is more contemporary, very short, but nice. The 7 o'clock is uh, uh, traditional and it's a very uh, moving using scripture. Right, at, right after the, the, the seven o'clock best, we have adoration on Fridays. So here's a great opportunity to um, get in touch with the Lord during this Lenten time. Uh, coming up is our uh, Lenten mission. It's going to be on from March 13th to the 15th. Uh, we begin in a very special way with having our own uh, Father Donald. Those who go to the mission know Father Donald very much. He is the uh, president and uh, of the Archbishop of Curley High School. His theme is making a life of, of journey of faith. Father Donald has, is a Baltimorean priest, uh, grew up in St. Clair's in Essex. He's one of us. He has, a, he has a very Franciscan aspect to, he wants to share with you. And I hope you can join us. That's going to be on <clears throat> Monday night, uh, Tuesday night, and on Wednesday night at 7 o'clock. We will have confessions um, almost every Saturday from two to three. But during the during the uh, mission, we'll have uh, confessions Monday one to two, Tuesday five to six, and Wednesday nine thirty to ten thirty. This will give you an opportunity to get in touch with the Lord, get in touch with you know how we get back to the Lord. There's so many things happening during Lent. I just want to get, make sure you get a part of it. Make the experience something very special. Again, in our um, in our Latin things, we uh, we have so many things happening. We have Tenebrae comes in this year. A Tenebrae is a service of a uh, uh, celebration of the darkness, uh, taught in scripture and ordinary mu music. Talk about the death and resurrection of the Lord. That's at six o'clock on Sunday, March twenty six. On uh, March thirty first, we have Living Stations. We where our youth group really puts out and dramatize in a very special way. The, the journey of the Lord and the stations across. I hope you can do that with us. And right before that, from 5 to 6, 6.30, we'll have a, a very small soup and salad uh, lunch, a meatless um, meal, just being together, and then we go to the living stations. So many things happening that we want to make sure you have the experience. Palm Sunday, we really have a regular schedule. Uh, I mean, we'll, we'll have the Passion of the Lord there, and um, again, right four, eight, ten, twelve at church, 9 11 at the mission holy thursday and uh is something very special we enter into triduum we have morning prayer every morning during uh during thursday friday and saturday at 9 30 at 8 30 in, in, uh, in main church again this is something special the whole church is new those three days is is really we, we enter the life of jesus the last supper his crucifixion and the holy saturday we have the resurrection so I'm not going to give you all the times again, but something, if you can look at the bulletin, look online, this is something very special. So Easter Sunday, uh, we have an added mass at 6.30 morning, quiet mass. So that everybody can be, but we have a regular schedule. And bring your family and celebrate them what we're about as Christians. So many things happening, our outreach program, our, uh, you know, confessions, you know, the celebration of Mass, the, the living stations, the mission. It's all about getting in touch with the Lord. And I hope that you can be with us this, during this time. Thank you very much, and happy Lent.